AJ Lee. Man, oh man, I have been holding back for a little while on making this particular video as well. So, these are uh, just three reasons why I'm uh, not really the biggest AJ Lee fan out there. So, if you love wrestling and you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button. Turn on all notifications. Help us hit 150 subs. All right. So look, a lot of what I'm going to say is opinion based, okay? I'm an old school wrestling fan. If you're new to the channel, I am an old school wrestling fan from the 80s, 90s, early 2000s. So that'll probably put your mind at ease at where I'm at with this. First and foremost, I just feel like she tries too hard to be this tough person, okay? In the ring and on the microphone. And if there's one thing I cannot stand in wrestling is a try hard. And what I mean is where their promos feel so forced, you know, where it's hardly believable. I know the 80s and 90s were very corny and cringy in their own way. But let me tell you, when a lot of those wrestlers would cut a promo, it would almost instill fear in you as the viewer, especially people like Psycho Sid and whatnot. Now, just, just you know, as a matter of opinion, most female promos, for the most part, I've never really found to be intimidating. And that could just be because I'm a guy, you know? I'm not saying that they don't try. I'm not saying that they aren't talented, but I just feel like, you know, wrestlers like AJ Lee just try too hard to say, I'm a bad bitch and, you know, I want you to know it. You know, I almost feel like your in-ring moves should, you know, kind of speak for themselves in that regard. Um, and yeah, it, it just, not everyone can cut a promo, you know? But I will tell you, AJ Lee, AJ Lee in the ring is very impressive, especially that Black Widow move. That's very cool. Moving on here, the skipping. What is that all about? I get it. It's part of the gimmick, I guess. The, oh, look at me, I'm so innocent kind of look. But really, I'm a tough person, <laughs> you know? Again, I'm sure I'm going to get slammed by people saying like, what are you just going to go after everything she does? And it's like, well, it's kind of the point of what a critique really is. You know, the skipping from a guy's perspective, 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 everyone comment perspective because I don't know how to speak today. But from a guy's perspective, it's just like, is the skipping thing kind of like a turn on? Is it sexy? Yeah, sure. Why not? Is that what she was going for? I don't know. Was it Vince's idea for the skipping? Was it hers? I'm not sure. But I was just never really a big fan of it, personally. And finally, I was reading an article about AJ Lee, which actually is what kind of inspired this topic uh, for me to do it today, was it said, psychoanalyzing WWE's most unstable diva, okay? And in quote, extreme reactions including panic, depression, rage, or frantic actions to abandonment, whether real or perceived. Now look, I was not watching wrestling much when AJ Lee was a prominent, you know, wrestler on the roster, but I saw plenty of replays and I caught the tail end of like her big career in WWE back in like 2015 and 16 and 17 around that time. And it definitely seemed like there was a lot of drama surrounding her both, you know, in kayfabe and in real life. And I could see that, you know, that, that was, I think, part of the big reason why she was no longer involved with WWE. I, I don't even know. Is she back now? I, I don't even know because I don't really follow the current product much anymore. Um, but yeah, you know, like, I think just her instability kind of showed through, you know, her wrestling and just, you know, her promos and whatnot, you know? Um, and I hope that she gets the help that she needs, you know, 
but those are definitely things that like you could you know notice is really what it is but look i did not want to make this just to be like an i hate aj lee video because i'm sure she's just a cool person you know so if by any chance she happens to be watching this okay you did it you made it you got famous you hit the big time you know and that should be you know a, a huge achievement for you you know so everyone watching let me know your thoughts in the comments are you a fan of aj lee why or why not don't forget to subscribe turn on all notifications hit that like button let's build the bond okay let's try and hit 150 subscribers and uh, until next time you know keep watching that wrestling we'll keep talking about it